This really requires understanding the strategy itself for the company. There's business strategy, and in our case, also an organizational strategy. We knew that we had to unify in the ways that I was talking about. We knew we had to empower or engage our people to 100%, and we had to bring them together in ways that was not a natural act uh, inside Helen of Troy, and that required a whole organizational strategy. We called it overhauling the organization and the people systems. So whether it was compensation, organizational structure, frankly the caliber of some of the people that we had, training, and later the very way that we were structured, meaning who reported to who, how the organizations fit together, the way they were incentivized. When we realized that this was so important in the business strategy, which had six other strategic choices, it all started fitting together to the point where we knew that that Global Leadership Council had to get itself to the next level. So we started with dispersed and no leadership team to the council, and we needed to turn ourselves into a team where that team came first. And that leadership change turned out to be a trigger, and it cast a shadow, as we often say, you know, shadow of leaders uh, is now in our vocabulary. And what that demonstrated to everyone else was that we had moved to the next level, and it was possible to cascade that through the whole organization and bring it together with the business strategy and unlock a whole new future for the company.